Hello friends, and welcome to another short Symbaloo tutorial. This video will teach you how to build and organize more efficiently with tile groups, tile markers, and the copy slash move feature. Let's first start with tile groups, a fantastic way to store related tiles. To create a group, simply click and drag any tile directly on top of another. Wait a couple of seconds, and there you have it. A new group should be created. Tile groups start with a four pack by default, but as you've probably guessed, you can expand your group to any size you wish. You may also want to customize your tile group by changing the tile icon, color, or the tile marker, which is our next topic. In Symbaloo, tile markers are super useful for highlighting or categorizing specific areas within your webmix. To add a marker, click on the Edit Webmix button and then select the markers option here. You can begin adding markers by clicking and dragging around the area you wish to highlight. Once an area is selected, you will be prompted to title the area and choose a background or marker color. If you want to adjust the area size in the future, you can do that here too. Lastly, and sort of unrelated to your webmix design itself, is the copy and move feature available for tiles. You can access this by right-clicking any tile and clicking copy move. As the name implies, this feature allows you to copy or move specific tiles and tile groups to your other web mixes. This is handy when you want to have the same tile in multiple web mixes, or if you need to quickly and efficiently rebuild or reorganize a web mix. With these tools, you can now customize your Symbaloo web mix to suit your needs better, whether for personal use, education, or in a professional setting. Experiment with these features to find the best setup for your online resources. That's all for now. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to visit us at Symbaloo.com.